what's up you guys it's valley vaughn back at you so today i actually meant to film because i went and got some lashes done i don't know i've just wanted more of a look to where when i wake up in the morning i i feel like i look a little bit more presentable and of course lashes do that that's why i've been like trying to get my skin together trying to do the lashes to where i kind of have a pull together look i'm going to do my gel nails today and my toes and I'm actually about to go into a Pilates class. So I have to stop at Target. I have to go to Target and I have to get some grip socks. Because I don't know if you've ever taken a Pilates class. But they require you to have grip socks when you go in there. So you're not slipping around. Um, I think most of you know if you've been following me for a while. But I had like an injury last year. So I'm trying to do like light exercise to really get back into moving my body and working out. So I think this is a good thing to try out. Bar is kind of like what ballerinas do, but it has Pilates mixed in. So I'm excited to try it. We'll see if I like it. If I like it, then maybe I'll look at a membership or maybe I'll just do like one-off classes here and there. So yeah, and then for my scent of the day, this was actually sent to me by Scent Beauty. So this is actually new to me today. This is from Sam Edelman. And this is called Signature. It's an eau de parfum. This is a 1.7 fluid ounce but it says whimsical florals refreshing greens it definitely smells very green warm wood spirited and refined it smells very elegant but look at this bottle isn't that so pretty i was like oh my god that is so gorgeous i guess they delivered it yesterday but i was like cooped up in my place all day just working and chilling um but yeah this is how the bottle looks it definitely smells very woody very green but then also with that elegant flair so it smells very mature i'm gonna wear it today and then give you guys like other things that i ordered some boots from target today so i'm gonna go pick those up and check them out and see if i like them if i don't like them i'm gonna return them but i've been looking for some brown boots for the longest so we'll see how i feel about those and yeah I think that's all i have to do today oh i have some like actual work to do this afternoon so i have to be home by like four which is good because i got my lashes done really early like 9 a.m so i could be at this um this pure bar place today at 11 so very busy day let's get going i'm so mad tell me why i just left the bar pilates class girl and why did i faint why did i faint i hate that for me i fainted i literally i passed out we were doing these workouts and then <laughs> i'm like a person that i'm susceptible i think that's the word to like passing out like i'll faint i'll black out i'll pass out <laughs> it's just me and we were doing a workout and i was just getting hot and all of a sudden i could no longer hear the music like the music was blaring in there it's a workout class i could no longer hear the music so I was like, oh shoot, I'm about to pass out. And then I started getting very hot. That feeling when you get really hot and really cold all at once. So that happened. And then I just got really dizzy and delusional. And I was like, I was trying to tell the instructor water. And I was like, oh, I couldn't speak. And then I was just like walking aimlessly around the class. And I found my way out. And I was like, do you have water? So she gave me, I don't know what was happening. My blood sugar dropped. Maybe I didn't eat or drink a lot, but I had like three granola bars this morning and a bottle of water, so I don't know. But I literally was about to pass out. I went out into the lobby. I sat down, drank some water. She gave me a candy bar, and then I went. I must have the courage to go back into the class and finish. But girl, that class was rigorous. I was like, I can't believe I passed out. It's so embarrassing. I hate that for me. But whatever. This is not the first time I've passed out in the class. I've passed out in maybe two other hot yoga classes so i'm just the kind of girl i'll faint on you i was like oh no so whatever but if you want to get in shape really quick i can already feel the results like my body feels so hard and so tight definitely do that <laughs> i did sign up for the membership though because i was like clearly i need to be doing this because your girl done passed out in here
So I don't know if I'm actually feeling like these colors, the like taller ones. I don't know. I just feel like when you have those kind of boots, when they're tall, I just feel like they have to fit really tight. Like I like them to fit really tight around the leg for them to look expensive. Cause when they're kind of baggy around the leg, I feel like it makes them look inexpensive and cheap. And then I love this color, but I just don't know how much I'm going to actually use that color. But for these, they're not bad. The shorter ones, like when I first saw them, I was like hideous. But now just looking at them, like they're not terrible. I feel like I can, I feel like I can get some use out of these. They look so long, right? <laughs> like, I'm like, is my foot that big? Something about this shoe, how it's built, it just looks so long, my man. But I feel like I can get some looks out of this. This would be a cute ankle boot for what I'm wearing. Mostly I'm getting them for work. And then I'm, I'm guessing I can pair it with like when I wear dresses and skirts and that sort of thing as well. I really want a dark brown though. I can't find dark brown boots anywhere. That's what I really wanted. But I'm definitely about to return the tall ones. We'll see how I feel about the shorter ones. But I think I'm about to go. This is the last day for Sephora's sale. I think I'm going to go get the Olaplex because I need to do my hair this weekend. And it's, wow, so dry and like breaking. So I want to make sure that I can get that to revive my hair. And I think we'll be good. Let's go. some darker makeup oops but anyways i want to show you guys this shot that i'm taking i'm really trying to benefit my health that's why you've seen me going to the bar classes doing x y and z i really want to become super super healthy so i've been taking this and don't look i'm actually doing my nails right now but i've been taking this ethan's daily detox apple cider vinegar shot and the flavor is ginger pineapple it says that it's a daily shot for your body and your body will thank you for it, okay? It says four teaspoons of organic apple cider vinegar supports digestion, curbs sugar, and curbs cravings. Um, recyclable and non-toxic glass bottles. So essentially you're supposed to just like detox your bottle, detox your body from all the toxins that of course we take in. I have to do something about, this looks so bright. This looks so bright. This is actually our first snowfall of the year. Let me show you. You can't really see, but it's our first snowfall of the year. OMG. Um, I was actually going to go to church today, but I decided to stay home, light my strawberry pound cake candle, and just detox my body. I also purchased the Olaplex, which I will show you. I purchased the Olaplex. So I'm gonna use that today as well, I'm trying to get my hair healthy. This is the number three hair perfecter. It re strengthens your hair. And then I also have the oil. So I'm gonna try these out again with my natural hair. But let me try to fix this makeup a little bit because I actually wanna film a video. I need like an actual press powder. I do not have an actual press powder. All I have is this from MAC. And this is the, this is medium deep. So this is kind of dark. This is actually my summer color. But it's like a loose powder, but I'm thinking that I can kind of just use it to make my foundation a little bit darker. It's kind of weird because I like it to be light around the eyes. Why is my light flashing? Um, but then like darker around here. I think that's working. Is that working? This needs some help right here. This is like so harsh. I think that was better. Oh girl, what a mess. What a mess. Side note, you saw me get my lashes done. I love this new look for my lashes. Like I told her I wanted to look wispy, still professional because I do go into the office and that's where I am most of the time. But I was like, I wanted to look like really wispy, 
um cute and like so i don't have to put on so much makeup because i found with my features i just feel like i always have to put on so much makeup to like really make my face pop and the certain features that i want to have come out like my eyes i always like to draw attention to my eyes and my lips so i feel like with the lashes it does that and i could just put on a lip gloss and go so yeah Oh my god, it's disgusting. It's, it tastes like vomit. Oh my god, it's disgusting. It better make me healthy. You know what's funny? I am the kind of person, like, when I go out, I will nurse a shot. Like, I can't, I'm not the kind of person. If I just throw it back, I'm going to the bathroom. Like, I'm, going, I'm about to go throw up. So I have to take a little bit at a time. Those girls, or even, well, the guys can do it, but the girls who could just take a shot, how? How, Sway? I will throw up. Anytime I've done that, I've always smiled, and they ran straight to the bathroom. Like, I know I'm about to throw up. It doesn't matter how much prepping I do, I'm going to the bathroom. So, I have to nurse a shot. Mm -hmm. ah! I'm sorry. This is so nasty baby you know something nasty when you start <laughs> either something's really good or really nasty when you start looking at the ingredients you're like what is in this oh it says apple cider vinegar of course water pineapple juice honey and ginger ginger juice organic gluten-free has 30 calories girl the devil is a liar mm. nasty but whatever you're done i don't know if you can actually see me but this is the sweater that i'm going to try to peel as you can see i just took it on a work trip actually and this is like a cheap sweater so it got all of these cotton balls all over it i don't know if you can like actually see it got all these cotton balls on it so i want to make sure i get all those cotton balls off because I found that like blue is my color and I really want to wear it. So we have this, we're going to try it on this sweater. Get the cotton balls off. I did wash it inside out to try to prevent because I was like, I have to wash it. As you can see, it has like a little bit, it's not terrible, but I want it to look brand new. And then I also have these pants are actually really, really bad. Kind of don't want to wear them though, because they're really big. As you got, if you've been following me for a while, you know, I lost some weight. So I'm like a size six now. And most of my closet is like size 12, size 10, my man. So I don't have like a lot of clothes that actually fit. I went from like a 31 to like now we're like a 28. So I don't have a lot of clothes that fit. So these are a size 10, but I guess if I wanna go for like a baggy pant look, then I could wear these, but as you can see, they have like cotton ball, cotton balls all over them, which I think just looks so bad. It's like small things you can do to actually make your clothes look better. So I got this from Amazon. This fabric shaver. This is from Conair. It says large shaving surface, easy grip handle. It um, renews clothing, reduces fuzz, lint peeling, that sort of thing. So we'll see. I have no idea how to use this actually. Hopefully it's just as simple as, oh, it needs batteries. Baby! They don't come with batteries? I hate that for me. Let me see. Hey Google, play Megan the Stallion. What's new? Hey Google, stop the song. Okay, I finally found batteries. That was such a nightmare. Sometimes I have to get inside my own head. Like, girl, where would you put it? What would Vaughn do? Have mercy. I have to read the directions, baby. Bam. And that's what two degrees of hard work and all that gets you. We're gonna turn it on. I don't know if I see the difference. I feel like you actually have to like press it hard. Hopefully this isn't like cutting my pants. Can you imagine? <laughs> Micro tears. Ew. The next thing that I'm doing that's super useless. I feel like I have all these shoes that I haven't, well, I have not worn in three years. It's been three years. And I'm like, oh, well, it's time to let them go. Before the three years, I hadn't worn them in probably two years. These are shoes I've had for 10 years and I have not worn them. 
um, for the last seven years. <laughs> so I am going to pull the trigger and actually throw them away. And just like, I just did it like a feng shui. Like I was walking around my place and I was just like, there's so much stuff, especially like doing what I do. People send you stuff and then there's more stuff. And I just need to be surrounded by things I actually like. But I want to show you these shoes that I did actually buy, which kind of prompted this. Because I was like, girl, you have shoes you actually like. I just got these shoes from Tarjay. They're super cute. And I was like, I have black boots, which I'll show you some of the black boots I have. But I was like, but I need brown. And I'm like going through here. And I'm happy I'm seeing that I actually don't have brown. But I have so many black shoes. Like, here's some. They're like so freaking dirty. But these are the shoes I used to like go out in like all the time when I was in college which I'm gonna keep because they're kind of cute but yeah I'm gonna go through here I'm actually gonna show you how it looks and I'm just gonna get rid of all these shoes it's time so this is the box of shoes it's a trunk that I have that someone gave me there's like so many shoes in here I'm just like going to get rid of them <laughs> to go in here i really want a plumping lip gloss so i'm about to go in here and see if i can get a plumping lip gloss <laughs>
So I am going in here for my second Pilates bar class. I'm gonna take you guys with me. Um, last time I passed out, I told you guys that. So we'll see if I don't pass out this time. I drank tons of water, I'm gonna bring water with me. Um, I didn't really eat much. I can't eat much in the morning. Like I can't have a breakfast of a champion in the morning. So hopefully I'll be all right, we'll see. Let's go girl. What's up? Your girl just came back from Paludus from Pilates. And I wanted to show you guys this outfit that I got. Um, I think I told you guys that I started going to Pilates maybe like two months ago. And I was looking for some really good gym clothing. Uh, you have to excuse my hair because, girl, we were sweating. She was trying to kill me with that ab routine. I told her after I, when I was about to go, I was like, girl, the ab routine was on point today. You know what's so funny is that you can like kind of see my abs coming through. But then also I'm like still have a big stomach. I was like, how are you gonna have a big stomach and have abs? But this actual outfit, so cute. Please check them out if you are looking for workout gear. Actually, I think it's supposed to fit like that. I have a very flattening 
um, sports bra underneath, but it's so cute. This is one of their sets. They have tons of cute sets, or you can buy them individually if you just want pants. Um, I love that it has these thumb holes. They're wet because it's raining really bad outside and they got soaked, but it is nice. It's very stretchy. It feels very comfortable. Um, I wanted pink because I just think pink looks really, really good on me. And then I'll move the camera down so you can see the bottom half as well. <sighs> and then this is the bottom half. Yes, excuse me, my room is destroyed. But this is the bottom half, really, really cute. I got a size medium in the top and in the pants. I think I could have done a large in the pants to have them come up even more high-waisted, but I have plans of like trying to lose weight, so I wanted them to fit after I lose or get to my goal weight. Um, but yeah, this is how it looks. This is one of the sets. I'm gonna try on the other sets as well. But I think it looks really, really cute. I will say if you have like a booty, I think maybe it's not designed for girls with booties because it does do that thing to where it kind of pulls a little bit. But I mean, that's to be expected. They have different kinds of sets to where I feel like this is more of like, okay, you're working out, but it's also a lifestyle kind of a set versus they have some more that are like gun ho for if you're going to the gym. Um, but yeah, I really like it. Let me pull it down so you guys can see me even more. Again, it has this logo right here. I feel like this is actually going to come off in the wash. So that's one thing to note. For the material, this is how the logo looks in case you're like wondering. Please excuse my nails. I'm actually about to um glue some nails on because since it's the holidays, I won't have to be typing every day so I can have long nails. But anyways, this is called, this is called the Nimble crop top and this is in pink size medium it's 90 percent nylon 10 percent spandex so it is very like fitted and i feel like it has some structure to it but again it is very comfy it's very comfy we were pretty much doing splits today in pilates and you know a lot of stretching that sort of thing and it did feel really good it did kind of roll down a little bit but i do think that's because i have a size that's maybe one size too small um, if you're in between sizes, I would size up um, unless you have plans on losing weight, which I do. Um, but other than that, I think it fits really, really good. I like that it's cropped, but it's not too cropped. You know, it's not like up here. You have like a few inches. They also have full size tops. Um, they have tank tops. They have pretty much anything that you're looking for. I like a full length pant. I really like a full length pant, but I mean, if you like more ankle, of course they have more ankle as well. But this is the first outfit and I feel like it is so cute. Again, I love the color. This is one that I might go back and get in a black because you could do so much black with black. But yeah, really, really like this outfit. This is from a brand called Gym Sweaty. So love this brand, super, super cute. Um, and just nice to run around in as well. Cause you know, we're working from home so much lately that we just need those kind of outfits to where we can look really cute in the house as well. Okay, so I quickly wanted to run through the other items that I have from Gym Sweaty Baby. Wait, this looks dusty. Okay, so I quickly wanted to run through the other things that I got from Gym Sweaty. This is a black bra. Really, really cute. I like it. It has a clasp actually on the back. Again, everything is size medium, but I think I should have done a size large because this is looking very, very skinty, like very tight. Um, it also has this pocket in the back here if you want to hold your valuables when you're working out or whatever. And then on the side, this is actually an ankle fit. Um, it has the Gym Sweaty logo. So really, really cute. Um, I would probably put a hoodie over this or something if I'm going to a workout class. Or this is a great layering piece. It is 69% nylon, 31% spandex. So that's the deets and you don't have to dry clean it. This is how it looks when it comes out of the packaging. It comes each individual one in a little bag. This is the other set. This is the one I was living for. It's got the ombre, did the ombre on them. Um, it goes from like a slate grayish white to this like teal color, super cute. Can already tell with the cuss that it has in there that's going to make the body look snatched. And I got a bunch of like long sleeves, well, like half and half because obviously it's winter and I wanna be wearing long sleeves as much. Of course, this is cropped as well and it has the thumb detail but i think this is super cute again everything is in a medium did i tell them i wanted a small i'm gonna cry if i said i wanted a small why did i do that oh i told them i wanted a small i don't know what i was thinking y'all but anyways this outfit is in a medium the teal but then i am a little bit crazy 
did I tell them I wanted a small in these? I sure did, because I remember they reached out and they was like, yo, what size you want? Because it's out of stock. And I was like, can you do a small? Because I have small um, titalicious, but we're gonna, we gonna see. I guess that's the motivation to lose the weight so I can wear these, but the, these tops are in a small. Um, we'll see, I'm gonna try them on. And these are the pants to go with that set. This feels more of like what you would wear just lounging around the house versus like hardcore working out. And this composition is, let's see, 90% nylon, 10% spandex. So yeah, I really like them. So excuse all the toilet paper. I just got my subscribe and save from Amazon. But yeah, I think the pieces are cute. Again, I'm gonna try them on, but yeah, check them out. I'm also eating this delicious meal from Bpop. You guys probably have one by you, but it's kind of like a Chipotle that's Korean food. We've got kale, um, red cabbage, carrots, cucumbers, egg, potatoes. Underneath there are, it's like this purple rice, and then there's also more veggies. So just trying to make sure I'm being healthy. This is actually really good. The sauce on top is teriyaki. Um, if it starts to get dry towards the bottom, because they're always like not generous with the sauce, then I'll put some soy but very delicious. Please check them out. Okay, update. There wasn't enough potatoes in there for me. So I went and fried some more potatoes with some rice. Yum. And then I added some kimchi. So this is like a very healthy moment, full of flavor. Um, Very rare for me. Usually I'm eating McDonald's, but this is nice. It's very good. It's a magnifique. <laughs> Excuse how destroyed I look. I just got back from Pelotos. But yeah, I wanted to show you the other set that I have. I could have done a medium in this. This is a small, but it's super cute. It actually clasps in the back and it's a sports bra. It has these wide bands. So I really, really like that. And then for the pants, let me prop you up so you can actually see boo. Oh my God, I look so hideous but whatever and then for and then for the pants they're these high-waisted um leggings this is how these are how the pants look super super cute um this is a size medium in the pants and they fit amazing the fabric is so soft and i found these actually stay up like i like this material it stays up when i'm doing my workouts and then it has this um gym sweaty this is the other outfit from Jim Sweaty, and it has that like emblem right there, which is super cute. And you saw it in the video. But yeah, these are high waisted. I mean, they don't stay up to where you could be doing anything and they won't roll at all. But I did find that these stayed up pretty good. Okay, so this is the other one that I have not actually worn yet. Um, very, very cute. This fits perfect. I think both of these are a size medium, I want to say. The top two. Um, but yeah, this is obviously long sleeves. It has these thumb holes. So if you're running outside, that's nice. I like the fact that it is cropped, obviously, but the pants are high enough to where um, it meets and you don't really show any stomach at all. This is great, especially in the winter. If you're going to be working out outside, if you still like to run outside or something like that. It has the emblem, Jim Sweaty, right there. And this came in a bunch of different colors, which I love. And I wish I would have got more. But I just love this ombre. It's so cute. I just love this ombre. I think this is so freaking darling. Honestly, like, this is so cute. 
This is like one of the cutest sets I've seen. This is something to where I feel like it's so cute to where I literally would just wear this out. Like, I don't know. I feel like this set is so cute to where you would just wear this out. Like, you don't have to be going to the gym or whatever. Um, if it's not translating, this is like a teal color. And then it goes to like a slate white color. And then obviously it has this threading here. Um, and then it has this like ribbed material, athletic material to kind of like keep the pants up as you're working out. Um, but yeah, I like it a lot. I love it. And again, they have so many different colors. I wish we would have got this in. They ha I think they had like, this was pink and then it went to a white. But yeah, love this one. Size medium, fits perfect. I'm about a size 6'8". Um, typically when I'm shopping for dresses. So if that gives you any indication. Um, I don't know how much I weigh. <laughs> but I'm about 5'5". Five, five. But yeah, super cute. If you're a tall girl, I also feel like these would work for you. Because this is like bunching at the bottom.